Apollo 40 Under 40. We are here with... I'm Tom Marks, the editor of Apollo. Amazing. So uh, what is this event about? This event is about an initiative that we founded four years ago. This is the fifth edition to celebrate young, talented people in the art world. And this party tonight is bringing together a lot of those people for the fifth edition of this list with people based in Europe. And it's really a party to celebrate them and to, to promote them for the future. So these awards are awards the best talent in Europe. It's, it's split between four sections. So people who are artists, who are collectors, who are thinkers working in museums or in the universities and who are working in businesses. Young entrepreneurs who are maybe doing really exciting things in the art world, maybe disrupting how business is done or maybe just doing traditional business really well. And we've run through the world. So we've been through Europe, America, uh, the Asia Pacific region and a global list last year and now we're really excited because this is our first chance to come back and start the second cycle. So I would define it as a democratic arts event. We're trying to be. We, w we, want, to, we want to look at people who are young and doing exciting things, things that are really going to be setting the pace, the cultural leaders of the future and I hope that many of them are here tonight. So the main sponsor of this event is Deutsche Bank. So how do you get this collaboration? How did you get it? Like? Well, we've been working with Deutsche Bank Wealth Management for a number of years, and this is really exciting that they have a real uh, belief in the value of young people in the art world and in supporting the art world, and that's been a really exciting thing to work on with them. So it's not true that financial world cannot match with arts? I don't think so. You look at their collection. Next week they're opening a, a, a new Kunsthalle, a new museum, really, in, in Berlin to show many works from their collection of works on paper and they support artists every year with their awards so I think they do an exceptional job in promoting and stimulating the art world. So talking about more specifically about the event tonight can you unveil some details? <laughs> I, I know this is before the awards so... You'll see all very soon. Uh, I can say that we've had great judges, uh, we've had judges from across Europe and that it's always really difficult because there are so many people who could be on that list. And that's why it's so exciting to do it every year, get new names in each time. So um, I've read about the, the judges and uh, we have quite a mixed um, audience and mi mixed, like, they, they come from different backgrounds, art, art curators, artists. What's that? Why that? Like, why did you decide to put that? Well, we want them? to make sure that we have, so Susan Phillips is an artist. We've got Ivana Blaswick, who's the director of the Whitechapel Gallery, Jasper Sharp, who works uh, in Vienna, Axel Ruja, Josephine Ackerman, uh, Elvira Diangani Oze, and that gives us a really exciting mix. Everybody is able to bring their expertise and give something different to the judging process. Perfect. So we look forward to see who is going to win this uh, competition, so these awards. <laughs> Thank you very much, Tom, for talking to us. Thank you very much. Thank you.